Hello everybody! My name's Gravity the Ghost, and it's been a long time since I've uploaded a video. Yes, I understand that. Um, don't worry, uh, things will be getting right back into the groove of things pretty soon. Um, but I just wanted to tell you guys that uh, the new NES Online games have arrived. Now, normally I don't really cover these things because usually, uh, obviously other people like Game Explain do it, but I honestly don't care. Because, uh, with the code that we got, I already opened up the new things that we got. We got Kid Icarus, we got Star Tropics, and we got two brand new SPs. SP Adventure of Link with Zelda 2, and SP Kirby's Adventure. And I bet you're saying, oh, these two special things are just going to be like every other one. Really crappy, and just take you to the final boss. Well, actually, they're pretty good. So, uh, first, uh, um... I know, a lot of people like to give the online, the NES games a bad rep, but really, to be honest, for me, I feel like this is worth my 20 bucks, because there's a lot of these games on here that I've never played before, like, uh, before this, I've never played a Metroid game before, and now I have. Um, I've never played Star Tropics before, and now I'm about to play it. <laughs> uh, what else? A lot of these third-party games I've never played before. Um, but anyway, let's get back to the four that were added today. Now, with Kirby, with Kirby Adventure and Kid Icarus, I've uh, I've already owned these games for you, the 3D Classic series on the 3DS. Um, but first, I want to get to the special versions. So let's we'll start with Kirby's Adventure. Uh, so basically, the way that they did this is basically it get basically uh, um, if you read it, it says in the special version of Kirby's Adventure, you can start playing through the extra to the difficult. And I don't know whether what they're talking about when it comes to difficult. I mean, this is Kirby we're talking about. <laughs> uh, an extra game, which is basically the old-time version of New, New Game Plus. Um, the mode usually is available only after beating the game once, which is untrue. Uh, I, I think so. Because uh, when you look at the file, it's, it's a 100% completion. Because uh, I don't remember this when on the 3D Classics version... But it's probably because I never got 100% completion on the 3D Classics version, so I don't know. Uh, it's been a while since I played Kirby's Adventure. But anyway, uh, aside from that, the sound test is also available, and not only that, it also the it also gives you the bonus mini games. Um, it also lets you uh, go through the boss rush, I think. And I, there was one other thing that I can't remember. Uh, <laughs> You can press the B button to stop a song from playing, but the Kirby soundtrack always has a way of getting stuck in your head. So yeah, let's go uh, ahead with that. And, but first, we're gonna do, yeah, actually, let's, yeah, let's go into the Kirby adventure. So yeah, perfect, hundred percent. So yeah, let's you play the bonus game, play the extra game, which is essentially the same game, but like, I guess difficult. I don't know what they mean by that. And then also the sound test, which is nice listen to the sound test music. Uh, let's play some random song. Oh, Zero A. Oh, wait, no! <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. Didn't mean to continue. We got bonus games. We got Crane Fever, which is the crane game where you can get extra lives. Quick Draw, which is 1-2 Switch. And the Egg Catcher. And also Boss Rush. Let's do some Quick Draw. Stop terrain. <laughs> no, wait. No, no, no. No, no, wait. I gotta restart. <laughs> this, this, I believe this is... I actually went on the easy setting. How do you, uh, no, uh, let me, uh, let me rest. I want to go back to, I didn't need to go to the easy. Let's go medium. Face each other. Ready, steady, fire! <laughs> Am I going to get copyright for that? Ready? Steady fire! <laughs> Ready, steady, fire! I got killed! No! <laughs> Kirby got yeeted! He got the chopper got him! Ah, <laughs> oh, that's always a fun 
I always love playing that thing in the 3D version. Let's play Egg Catcher. I forgot how to play this. Press the button to make Kirby's mouth open. Try to eat the eggs, but not bombs. Oh. Oh, it's a mini game. It's a. Oh, I ate a bomb. These are some of my cool mini games. And I already know what Crane Trooper does. And obviously, versus boss is the boss rush. Uh, so yeah, let's continue out of that and move on to, uh, SP like, uh, Zelda 2. It's a secret to everybody. Start this version of Zelda 2 with your attack, magic, and life all maxed out at level 8. So yeah, it basically gives you a head start on everything. You got all your health, you got all your magic, and you got all your attack all the way up. You won't start with any items, but you'll be able to use all that magic you plow through your enemies with a souped up link. Clear the six palaces, take on the great palace to win back the Triforce of Courage. Quiz time! Uh, okay, yeah. So basically, this is actually something that I actually wanted in the, the past Zelda SB. So basically what this one was, it gave you all of the items, but it didn't take you to the beginning of the game, it only took you to around the end where Mother Brain is. Um, but this one, it literally just starts you off at the beginning of the game with... Ed, with if you super powered up and you just go through the game. Obviously you don't have all the items, but you're basically like super powerful. Let's go through. Oh, we have all our magic too. That's cool. Say you have all the magic too. Um, I'm not gonna play through that because uh, I suck at Zelda 2. Um, so let's get on to Kid Icarus. I've already played Kid Icarus before in the 3D classics, um, so I know my stuff. I know how to play this game. What the heck? Why are the sound effects so quiet? <laughs> like, listen to a pit jump. It sounds so quiet, what the heck? Why is it so quiet? Oh yeah, this is always like the really stupid room. <laughs> but if you wanna if you wanna be really honest with Kid Icarus, this game has not aged very well. <laughs> However, uh, you gotta admit it's it's a pretty cool game. One thing I do enjoy... What, but the 3D Classic version is actually much better because it lets you shoot, it lets you jump while aiming upwards, but obviously it doesn't let you do that. And usually, you want to go through there, but you actually, get, you actually go through here if you want to keep it for easy and not go through the Reaper. And also you can uh, fight the Spec Noses here. Which actually are uh, pretty difficult sometimes. Can really mess you up at the beginning of the game. And I died, yay! I'm finished! Yeah, I'm finished too. <laughs> Alright, now let's go on to the game that I have never played before. Uh, I actually don't know anything about this game for as old as it is. It's Star Tropics. So let's see how it is! For what it sounds like, it has some rocket music. Oh, it's got a Zelda. From what I heard, it's like it's like Americanized Zelda. From what I heard from people. Uh, so let's just put our name here. Click gravity. Hopefully, it'll let us fit that many letters. They'll probably be like, oh no, only five allowed. Sorry. Oh no. Looks like it. No, 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 no. Yes. Thank you. There we go. Gravity. One day in summer, you met you land at Sea Island where Dr. Jones has his laboratory. Laboratory. Oh, this is pretty cool. So 
just like a little action RPG or something. We're we going in town, right? Welcome to Cora Coral Cola. Yeah, it's Americanized. What the heck is this? It's like a it's like a Final Fantasy type thing. What the heck? Oink oink. Yes, yes. Very well said. Where do you come from? Americola! Oh my gosh, I'm done! It's kind of Americola! Yeah, this is like a Japanese take on America, probably. Who are you? Stay away from here! Your uncle, Dr. Jones, is so nice, we call him Dr. J. Oh, last week I met Dr. J. He was very busy solving some strange puzzle. I love how they didn't put a period at the end. Last night I gazed up at the Southern Cross. Suddenly, I saw so many shooting stars. Legends say shooting stars are omens of disaster. Oh me, oh my! I heard you were coming. Wanna go fishing? Nah, son, I don't, I'm good. We ain't doing that, not here. What's this, that random patch of grass? Why can't I go through it? So where is this, uh, doctor? Is he, is this it? Oh, I've been waiting for you. I'm Chief Cora Cola. Cola, Coral Cola. And a good friend of your uncle. Listen, Mike. I have some bad news. Last night. Try not to be too upset, but your uncle, Dr. Jones, has been adopted. We must keep this from the islanders so they don't panic. You are the best hope of rescuing Dr. Jones. I don't know what to do. Can you help? Yes or no? Sure. Good, you're brave. Take this star. You may think this star is just a toy, but it's very powerful. Mike, you're an ace pitcher! Use it! You've got a star! E? Mike, it looks peaceful around here. But in the dark below, many monsters have appeared these last few years. And don't let them get to you. Mike, the fate of your uncle is in your hands. Find a tunnel in the village, and hurry to Dr. J's laboratory. Well then, this is this is actually a pretty cool game. I like this. I might continue playing this after recording. Uh, I didn't know such a game existed on the NES. It looks pretty fun, and I like the Amer the ja you know the Japanese take on America humor. That's kind of the same thing with Earthbound. I have never played Earthbound either. Mike, your uncle told me about you. I feel like we are old friends. What? Just so my uncle. <laughs> <laughs> I don't, I don't, I don't get it. I miss Coral 90, 1990. Do you think I'm pretty? Oh, I'm Miss Coral 1990. Oh, a play on words of a play, like a, a joke on Miss America. Have you met our chief yet? He's waiting for you. It's almost like an action, like a Zelda, as if Zelda had more RPG-ish elements. Which obviously it does now where you can talk to NPCs and such. But back in the first Zelda, obviously not. This is really cool. I like it. Here's the tunnel. Oh. Cool. What? I'm the shaman and sister of the Iron Chief. Your uncle has his well abducted because he found a secret in the Lost Ruins. I have great hope that you will be succeeding in rescuing Dr. Jones. Just like your North Star, island sailors look for the Southern Cross. Mike, many wilderness well monsters await you in the dark below. But remember, the magic of the Southern Cross is always on your side. Now begin your test of island courage. Good luck. I try my best to sound like a like a mystical lady, old lady or something. And the oh look, and he's much he's much taller. Yo, this music is bopping though. So press A is jump, and B is the star, but it's literally just a yo-yo. What if this guy was in Smash instead of Ness? Think about that. That would be really cool, actually. Okay, so you get so you can jump on these. Okay, and I guess you enemies with this. Yo, this game is really cool! It's like a puzzle. Puzzle action RPG. And this music is really bopping! 
And you're collecting stars, I'm guessing, is that like the currency or something? This is like if Zelda was took took place in America. I'm really liking this. Um, I don't want, okay, this is, I don't want this video to, I don't, I don't want this video to drag on for too long, so I'm going to just create a save state. Uh, I don't know if the game saves or not. And we're just going to go back and uh, we'll stop here. Uh, I don't want this game to go, this video to go on for like 20 years. Because uh, <laughs> I got other stuff to work on. Uh. But yeah, this this lineup is actually pretty nice. The SP games are, re are really good. They're not like literally just go to the final boss and that's it, have fun. Um, they're actually really nice, and the new games that we got, Kid Icarus, and though it hasn't aged very well, it's still a classic, and people love it. And Star Tropics, I had no idea this of this game existing, and it, 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 it seems like it's really cool, and I probably might be continuing playing this after recording this video. The music is really cool, too, and it's it's almost like, if, like I said, it's Zelda, and maybe like if Zelda and Earthbound had a love child. Uh, so yeah, thank you guys for watching the video, uh, especially, I mean... Surprised if you wanted to come to this 16 minute long video or so. <laughs> what you doing? <laughs> but yeah, this has been Gravity Ghost, and I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day. Uh, see you later!